Hello there, I'm your host Dan Rojas. For this experiment, I'll be using the finest grade steel wool commercially available with a rating of 25 microns or roughly one fifth the size of a human hair. A drop of regular tap water is suspended in the web of steel by water tension alone. Using our super macro lens mounted to our high speed camera, we are able to capture detailed imaging at 300 frames per second, equaling a 10 to one time ratio. This giant piece of metal entering the frame is nothing more than a small electrical jump lead or alligator clip energized with 12 volts of direct current. Once a good connection is established, allowing current to flow within the water droplet, tiny bubbles begin to form consisting of hydrogen gas on the cathode or negative terminal and oxygen on the anode or positive terminal. Because no electrolyte was used, this process requires excessive energy. Steel wool is commonly used by survivalists and outdoorsmen as an alternative method of starting a fire. Fine diameter steel wool like this will easily burn by adding the current from a small A battery. Using the surface of an expired incandescent light bulb, a drop of water stays in place. Adding two individual electrodes made from the steel wool fiber also produces the hydrogen and oxygen bubbles. One interesting observation with this experiment is the formation of sticky microstrands that are much thinner than that of the 25 micron steel wool electrodes. This is electrolysis within a water drop. I'm your host Dan Rojas. Thank you for watching and enjoy our videos.